too often we think that once the soldier, the last soldier, have left the battlefield, that the war is over. And we do not think in terms that the war continues, the nightmares continue, in the lives of the people who are left in the various countries, such as Vietnam, to relive it uh, year after year after year. There is a tremendous link for me personally and also for the convention that I represent between civil rights and the situation of the cleanup in uh, Vietnam. Uh, because it is a matter to us, of, it's a social justice matter. I had relatives and friends who served in Vietnam who are with me in ministry now, who are still reliving the trauma uh, of the war. And so uh, it was an opportunity for me to go back and to engage in that. And also it brought some healing to me also because there were friends I lost uh, from a personal note, when I was stationed in the military, I was in an area where some testing of the Agent Orange dioxin was used. And I have some neuropathy in my uh, hands and uh, feet. But by the grace of God, uh, I am not faced with the kind of uh, trauma that I saw the families and the children and even some of our veterans are facing now. And then to actually visit the sites. I start reliving in my own mind speeches that I heard early in life of Dr. Martin Luther King uh, when he was challenging uh, to uh, close the war and that to bring our troops home. And when I saw the children issues, it reminded me so much uh, how blessed we are here in the United States. It forced me to look at uh, what we can do, particularly as an interfaith group, uh, when we forget our differences and look upon how we can come together in dialogue and communication about reaching uh, across the aisles. It does not matter our political beliefs. It does not matter to me uh, personally about our religious beliefs, but it's the issue of concern about people in general. We need to sit down to reason together and it is my hope and prayer that we will uh, come together to clean up the situation there and other places throughout the world to make this a better place for all of us to live in peace and harmony.